How to install and configure ADRMS What's is ADRMS? Active Directory Rights Management Services, ADRMS, is an information protection technology that works with ADRMS-enabled applications to help safeguard digital information from unauthorized use. ADRMS can be used to restrict access to an organization's intellectual property. Limit the actions users can perform on content. Limit the risk of content being exposed outside the organization. Lab requirement. Windows Server 2019. DC, DNS. Client machine, DC member. Install MS Office 2007 or above in client machine. In my case in am going to configure ADRMS on same DC machine. How to configure ADRMS? Go to Server Manager. Click on Tools and select Active Directory User and Computer. Expand Domain Name. Click on User. I am going to create four user. Rohit, Sam, Vineet and RMS Admin. After created users. Set all users mail ID. Select all users. Go to properties. Click an email. Put command. Percent username percent at ours.local. Click on Apply and OK. Provide group membership of Enterprise Admin and Schema Admin to RMS Admin User. Right click on RMS Admin User and select Add to Group. Type ENT and click Check Name and select Enterprise Admin, click on OK. Press semicolon key and type SCH and click Check Name and select Schema Admin then click OK. Click on OK. Go to Run. Type GP Update then press Enter. After updating this policy I am going to install and configure certificate service on this server. Go to Server Manager. Click Add Roles and Feature. Click on Next. Select Role Based and Feature Based Installation. Click on Next. Click Active Directory Certificate Services. Click Add Feature. Click on Next. Click on Next. Select Certification Authority Web Enrollment. Click Add Feature. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click Restart the destination server automatically if required. Click Install. It will take some time to install Roll.
Click Configure Active Directory Certificate Service on this server. Click on Next. Select Certification Authority and Certification Authority Web Enrollment. Click on Next. Select Enterprise CA. Click on Next. Select Root CA. Click on Next. Select Create a new private key. Click on Next. Click on Next. Fill common name for the CA. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click on Configure. Click on Close. I am checking certificate services is proper installed or not. Go to Tools and select Certification Authority. My Active Directory Certification Service is proper configured. Now I am going to Tools and select Internet Information Services. Click on Server and double click on Server Certificate. Click on Create Domain Certificate. Fill all distinguished name properties. Click on Next. Click on Select. Select Certificate. Click on OK. Fill Friendly Name. Click on Next. My domain certificate is saved in IIS. Now I am going to install role and configure ADRMS. Go to Server Manager, select Add Roles and Features. Click Next. Select Roles based or Feature based installation. Select on Active Directory Write Management Service. Click Add Feature. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click on Next. Click Restart the destination server automatically if required. Click on Install. Click Perform Additional Configuration. Click on Next. Select Create a new ADRMS root cluster. Click on Next. Select Use Windows Internal Database then click on Next. Click on Specify and fill ours admin user and password. Click on OK. Click on Next. 
select cryptographic mode 2 then click next. Select use ADRMS centrally managed key storage then click next. Fill ADRMS cluster key password. Click on next. Click on next. Fill fully qualified domain name. Click on next. Select certificate. Click on next. Click on next. Select register the SCP now then click next. Click on install. ADRMS is proper configured. Click on close. Click on close. Go to tools and select active directory write management service. Click on yes. RMS server is proper configured. After RMS server configured go to client machine. Log on as domain user. Open any Microsoft application. In my case I am open Microsoft Word. After open word type some text. Click on office button. Click on prepare. Click on restrict permission. Click on restricted access. Click on yes. Fill username and password. Click on OK. It will searching a DRMS server. Word find RMS server. Click on restrict permission to this document. I am enter the SAM user email for access the document and view the document only. I am enter the RMS admin mail ID in change column. Because RMS admin can change this document, click on OK. Click on office button, click on save as and select word. I have a share folder in server it name is docs. I am going to access server and save the document in this docs folder. Fill file name and click on save. Close all console and sign out the Vanit user. So I am test the RMS server works. I in log on the SAM user and access server and open the restrict document. If it will show document only viewable that means my AD RMS server works. After log on the SAM user. Access the server.
Open Docs folder. Open RMS protected document. Click on OK. Click on Yes. Fill SAM user name and password. SAM user have only viewable permission. Click on OK. Click on View Permission. My ADRMS server works properly. So I am going to check RMS admin have a change rights of this documents. Close all console and sign out the SAM user. Log on as RMS admin user. Access the server. Open Docs folder. Open RMS protected documents. Click on OK. Click on Yes. Fill RMS admin user and password. Click on OK. Click on View Permission. RMS admin have changed rights of this documents. My AD RMS server works properly. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates.